Uh, clearly, master spies. Excuse me, man. This cannot be him. Is he American? Look out, lady. Major Finn again, funky. Extremely. None of him. Finn McNessar. British intelligence. So, Major. Average intelligence. Mater is the truck who knew too little in Cars 2, voiced once again by Larry the Cable Guy. The dim-witted tow truck is mistaken as an undercover American spy while playing sidekick to Lightning McQueen as he races in the World Grand Prix across several continents. Finn McMissile, voiced by Michael Caine, and Holly Shiftwell, voiced by Emily Mortimer, are the British agents who tap into his abilities to catch the mastermind who's sabotaging the races. Make me a monster truck! Request acknowledged. What the? <laughs> Mater's <laughs> got other problems though in his personal life. He embarrasses himself at a high profile racing event and Lightning, voiced once again by Owen Wilson, sidelines him to keep him out of trouble. We need your help, Mater. You know I'm just a tow truck. It's his cover. Brilliant. The first film, despite having talking cars, never felt juvenile or cartoonish. The same can't be said for the sequel. It often swerves into that territory, where the original celebrated American racing history, Route 66, and the idea of saving a declining American town, this one has a one-track mind, pun intended. It's focused solely on poking fun at those old Bond films in the 1960s. It's entertaining at times, but this film just doesn't have the horsepower or the heart of the first movie. The in-jokes that are hidden in nearly every scene are often more interesting than what's going on front and center. It's still got amazing computer animation and the kids will love it, but I found Cars 2 to be a bit disappointing. It earns just two and a half out of four stars. At the box office for Eat News, I'm Morgan Dean.